All right, so uh, Saturday over here at uh, uh, 12300 Aztec Place. Uh, this d guy right here parked the car uh, in my space. So I left him a little note. Let him know, move his car. Um, all right, so we added the mulch and some flowers in the front. The grass needs to be cut. Uh, the door needs to be painted. The windows on the outside, there's some areas like right there that are opening. We need to caulk those off and seal those down. Same thing here. This is like a pre-inspection. So when the buyers get a home inspector, we want to go ahead and address all these issues now because the inspector is going to find these little areas. You see right here, this window seal is coming off. So go take this wood off and fix this window seal up. The inspectors are going to see these things. So we want to make sure our transaction is smooth and we address all these little loose ends. Uh, do it now so we don't have any issues. So we're going to trim the trim some of these bushes back here and uh, some of these clean some of this stuff up, these bushes, some landscaping and come in the back. Somebody's dropping some trash and get this picked up. And these bushes have gotten too big so they got to be trimmed down and Okay, so back here, tighten it up. The, uh, there's vines growing up here on the side of the house. And there's extra cable wires from the dish up there. We're gonna cut them wires down because the inspector's gonna be like, what the hell are these wires are doing here? So we don't want any exposed wires. That'll bring up additional issues. The little um, bird nest inside of this uh, vent right here. So the trash, just a little bit of trash left. Um, added some mulch and a couple of little small trees back here. Power wash has been done. That window right there, the window seal is cracked. So is that one up there. And then the, the drain spout and the flashing back here needs to be painted. Okay, and this window right here in the kitchen. The wood is good, it's just solid. It just, uh, we need to sand it down and, uh, and paint it around this door area right here as well. Paint this here, remove the trash, and um, do some landscaping back here. So, we've been driving around looking at the different homes for sale. So it's got some competition. That's why we gotta tighten this thing up, make sure it looks good. So when we come out the gate, uh, we hit it right with the first 15 days. Okay. All right, so this right here, this threshold, right here, we're gonna tighten this thing up here. Um, the steps, the carpet, some of the the handrails. We need to, we need to get the handrails painted. Uh, paint these things white. Okay. Paint these things white. Get these scuff marks off of here. Um, the house has already been painted, and. Um, Crown molding. The windows need to be cleaned, the window ledges. And this wood right here is damaged. So that, again, this is part of the pre-inspection that we do before we list the property and do a walkthrough to make sure that we try to catch as much of stuff so it doesn't scare the buyers and we try to provide a good product and then get try to get the top dollars for it. All right, so um, this is the living room slash sitting room area, and the uh, front door goes down and we turn over here to the to the kitchen. Here's the half a bathroom. Um, so we're already putting a new vanity. So here's the new vanity and the new vanity top. 
Okay, so now we got it because the vanity top was different size. We took the old one out. We have to tighten up the edges here. We gotta fix this about almost an inch a gap. Fix all this down here and get this thing secured. Um, the plumbing under here, the hot and cold supply line has already been put together. So, just gotta clean this bathroom up. This is okay, this is okay. Keep this. Replace the toilet seat, it's got all kinds of piss stains on there. I'm not cleaning it, we just replace it. Oh, put a threshold down here for the carpet and the tile. This is a threshold. So, and um, ceiling fan needs to be clean, it's dirty as hell. Uh, it's got all the dirt on here. So the new cabinets are in. The granite, the guy finished today. So we got the stove already here. We got the, uh, the dishwasher sitting inside of this box. And we got the microwave. And we got the faucet that's gonna go uh, inside right here where the faucet is gonna be installed. So new undermount sink. Baltic brown is the granite. Home Depot cabinets. Okay, so these cabinets, it took a long time to find the size. We had to adjust the size because the old cabinets, what they had in here, and you, as you can see, there's a little bit of an opening, so they didn't make those sizes. So we had to make a lot of some adjustments here in the, uh, in the kitchen. So which, and plus you couldn't find this sucker. It took us, we had to go to Manassas, Oxen Hill, Brandywine. East West Highway, uh, Woodbridge, five different Home Depot to get this little damn cabinet right there. So that costs money. And um, the dishwasher is gonna slide in here. It needs to be connected. We need to get a plong, a three uh, prog plong with the plug that's gonna be about $30. And then we need to get us a plug for here for the uh, stove. So the wire from the stove, the back of the stove, that's gonna be connected from there. That's gonna get plugged into this thing here. So we need a wire that's for that. And then we need a plug. So the wire is about $25 and the plug is about $20, $25 here. Okay, this is where your refrigerator is gonna go here. So gotta tighten up these little areas. And then we need knobs for your cabinets. Put little knobs for your cabinets. Okay, so the ice maker line is gonna go through here. We're gonna make a hole, make a hole, bring the ice maker line, and then have the ice maker line connected. It's gotta get connected to the uh, to the cold water. The garbage disposal needs to go in. The hot and the cold supply line needs to go in. The dishwasher needs to get connected. The dishwasher kit needs to get connected to the dishwasher for the proper drainage. So, right now, you can see right there, Ain't nothing there. Okay, so this is the kitchen at Aztec Place. And, um, you know, we have to adjust the floor as well because of the cabinets. So we have to make some adjustments there to the floor. All right, so two, 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 we're going to go upstairs. The ceiling's been painted, the house is. Okay, the doors need um, the only problem I see with this these doors you have these nice doors here you got nice closet doors the bathroom doors there and then you got these these flat cheap doors here so that's the only thing but hey that's not an inspection issue that's a cosmetic issue okay so uh, and then this crown molding right here has a crack So we gotta sand that down and put some compound and then get all these windows cleaned up right here. All that stuff. Okay, we checked all the windows to make sure all the windows locked properly and all the locks were working. And uh, we're gonna keep this light the way it is. Fix that smoke detector right there. Right there, Pierce's been painted. 
huge closet okay the new vanity already went in for the uh, master bathroom there's a new vanity got the new faucet but this tub looks dated um, this tire looks dated so fix all this right here because the vanity was older it was a tad bit bigger and see this closet door is flat closet door this is a flat closet door now this door has a trim around the door so this door you go out that way and then this door here you go out into the bedroom so the doors I believe should match so the towel rack is going to go up here so that's sitting right here so we're going to put this back up all right so um, this is the master bedroom carpet and everything in here has been painted, caught. Okay. So, let's tighten up the uh, the door knob there. The window blinds they still need to be uh, replaced here and here. The window blinds. Okay, this is the master. The ceiling fan needs to be cleaned. The windows need to be cleaned. This is the other bathroom. It's got the vanity in here. Okay, so we gotta tighten up back here. A couple little openings, caulking and stuff. So it's got the drawers. So the right there gotta put a piece of cord around. And we still gotta put the knobs on here. Here's some of the supplies sitting over there. In the wall, we gotta tighten up the wall. This bedroom back here, we kept the metal doors, uh, just painted them. Uh, they're functional, they work fine. Nice door, nice window. The blinds have been replaced. Um, ceiling fan needs to be cleaned. So basically the house needs to be clean like before it goes on the market. You have to get it professionally cleaned, like thoroughly. Get it dusted, get it cleaned, and get it wiped down. <clears throat> Just like you're trying to sell a car, you're not gonna sell a dirty ass car. You're gonna make sure you lease vacuum the damn car. You know, so same thing here. You wanna lease like this shit, you wanna lease uh, you know, get this cleaned up. You don't want that. Okay, so this wood here. Okay, this wood on the window ledge. Let me sand that down and get that painted. The inspector's gonna see that. We wanna make sure the windows lock. Okay. Closet doors painted. Ceiling fan needs to be cleaned down. Uh, the carpet will need to have it cleaned. I would say professionally because it's got some wear and tear, some stains on it. Uh, need to put a cord around in there. Okay, so these are the things that need to be done over here at Aztec Place. This is going to be a challenge. We're going to have to retile the floor on the bottom to uh, level that off. But I think we should consider redoing something with the master uh, bedroom there. I mean, the bathroom. So, all right, I'm going to go downstairs. Okay. You see this here? Coming up, tighten that down. A little Okay. Got that there. Okay. 
Jay is off.